we'll see with confinement is uh, confinement will only be effective within the reinforcement. So we'll call this the concrete core. The outside area, um, the area outside the reinforcement is the cover. And what will happen is this will just fall off. So uh, this led to the uh, ACI uh, minimum, uh, minimum confinement reinforcement or minimum transverse reinforcement expression. So essentially what they said is they wanted the, uh, the strength before, uh, before the cover falls off. So without confinement, Uh, to be greater than or equal to the strength after. So only, um, I guess, only uh, taking into account the confined cover or, or core. And so that's how they found the expression. Um, so I guess this leads us to some of the takeaways. So we have uh, three main takeaways from uh, con the confinement discussion so far. The first is that confinement will happen. So if you have reinforcement and, it, and it's uh, you know sur surrounding some core, there will be confinement in your section. Uh, when confinement does happen and uh, your core concrete you know goes into the higher strengths and higher ductilities your cover is going to fall off so the final point is that uh, we need to ensure that the confined section is stronger than the original section or else there's going to be a brittle failure so I, I miswrote that up here we need to ensure that our confined section our strength after confinement is stronger than the strength before or when we lose our cover our section is just going to fail.